Our people in Malaysia's southern state of Johor are weighing COVID-19, economic concerns and monsoon woes ahead of the national poll. Analysts say this may lead to low voter turnout, especially in flood-prone areas. But with 26 parliamentary seats up for grabs, the largest in peninsula Malaysia, political parties will be going all out to woo some 2.5 million voters come rain or shine. CNA's Tan Su Hui reports. This school became an evacuation centre for 20 families in early October after floods swept their homes in Pontian district. This man and his family of eight took shelter in this classroom. With families still reeling from the devastation, the coming general election is the last thing on their minds. The 15th general election will be held in November, so campaigning and polling day will likely happen amid heavy rainfall. With the monsoon season fast approaching, there's a possibility of low voter turnout. And this happened during the 13th general election as people did not want to go through the extra trouble to vote. Furthermore, Johorans had already turned up for the state elections merely months ago in March. So analysts say they may be less motivated to turn up again. And the floods aren't the only worry on their minds. Cost of living has gone through the roof. The value of the ringgit has gone down. And to be honest, a lot of people are just blaming the politicians. Um, it's not like they're blaming external global factors or the war in Ukraine. They are actually blaming the politicians. So in that sense, we don't really know if they believe their vote can make a difference. So they might just give up. Johorans we spoke with echoed these sentiments. But younger voters feel the coming elections may bring about some change. We hope our new government can provide us a different, different kind of uh, environment, uh, different kind of future. Hoping for change. Hoping for change in what way? Uh, I mean, in the economic, in education, in health, everything. Problems aside, the earlier Johor state elections are telling. Only 50% of eligible voters came out to vote, one of the lowest voter turnouts ever. This led to a two thirds majority win by Barisan Nasional during the Johor state election. And BN hopes to capitalize on that despite the impending monsoon season. Tan Sui Hui, CNA, Johor Bahru.